Bum 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 bum. Tomatoes. Hello, welcome to video four. What is Launch Earl? This is a pretty simple node. This allows you to basically open up a web browser and launch a website for the user to view. So the Launch Earl itself is node is pretty simple. It simply takes in a string for the URL itself. And when you run it, it launches it if it can. So if I was to play this and I hit go, well, I have a web browser open up on another page right here and we can see it's msn.com. Let me go back to here and let's go back to our example and close it out. Let's go ahead and go to here and let's do something like HTTP unrealengine.com. I'm going to go ahead and hit play and hit go. And you notice Unreal Engine loads up. That's it. It's pretty simple. It's going to allow you to open up a website for the user. Now you might be thinking, well, this is kind of silly, but it's not. Maybe you have an end user license agreement, which is pretty big or can be updated a lot often. If you allow them to view the end user license agreement through the launch URL, you can then open up a current version on your website. Same thing with maybe you want them to view other games or you want to launch directly to your Play Store page, things like that for advertising purposes or informational purposes. Now there is a complimentary node to go with this called Can Launch Earl. So we're going to go ahead and plug in, we're going to copy and paste. And you saw it work earlier. And we're going to run this and we're going to get back a false. I'll run it a couple more times. We're going to get false. This node technically is working properly. If we were to go into our output log and we look right here, we're going to get this message. It's a generic message for the generic platform process saying can launch URL not implemented on this platform. What that means is right now as of 4.14, this node right here can launch URL only successfully returns back a valid result if you're on the iOS platform. If you are not on the iOS platform, this is basically going to be the generic impl implementation and return back false. So that's just a heads up and an informational thing. Don't count on can launch URL to actually work. Do any sort of validation you might need or don't allow the person to type in their own stuff. Use this for your own informational and display purposes. And as far as I can tell, this should work on all platforms supported by Unreal Engine at this time. And that's it. That's going to wrap up our launch URL node.